Here's how to play Minecraft on a Mac. If this video helps you, all I ask in return is that you subscribe. Let's go. Okay, so the first step is to open a browser, like for example, Safari, which is a default browser on Mac. And in here, you want to type in Minecraft.net and then you want to open the Minecraft.net site. You can press return after you have typed Minecraft.net. That is going to place you right here where we're going to scroll down and we're going to choose Minecraft Java and Bedrock right here. That is going to put you right here where you're going to scroll down one more time and then you're going to choose platforms and you're going to choose Windows, Mac or Linux and you're going to click buy now. That is going to put you right here where you're going to choose the edition of Minecraft that you want to play. In this case, it's going to be the standard edition for me. And then you want to continue with checkout. It is $29 though. As you know, Minecraft is not free. So you're going to have to purchase it. Just make sure you log in with the Microsoft account that you remember the logins to. So later on, you'll be able to play with your Microsoft account where you own Minecraft. Now, if you already own Minecraft in a Microsoft account, you don't have to rebuy it. You could just log in with the Microsoft account where you already own Minecraft, which is what I'm about to do. Now I went ahead and log in with the account where I already own Minecraft. And once you log in and you purchase the game, or if you already own the game, it's going to give you this prompting here where it says download for Mac. And that's exactly what you're going to press in there. Now that'll begin the download over here. It might prompt you and you're going to have to allow it. And then that'll begin the download for the Minecraft.dmg file. Now, once you got that file downloaded, you want to open your downloads in here and you want to double press that file. Now, after you open the Minecraft.dmg file, it's going to give you this prompting here, this pop-up. Just go ahead and drag and drop the Minecraft file into the applications. And after you drop the Minecraft icon into the applications, you could close this pop-up in here and now head over to your launchpad over here and search for Minecraft on the top in here and you should see Minecraft in here and now you could go ahead and press it. You could also put it down here on your dock in case you want to open Minecraft easier from down here, right? But I'm just going to go ahead and open it from here. And once you press on Minecraft, it's going to give you this pop up in here. Just go ahead and click on open. And now just wait a couple of seconds while the Minecraft launcher installs properly in your computer. And then once the launcher finishes installing, it's going to open like this in here. And now it's very important that you log in with that Microsoft account where you purchased the game earlier. So make sure you sign in with that Microsoft account because if you use the wrong one, you won't be able to play Minecraft. You will have to buy it again. And then once you log in, just click on the Let's Go pop up that is going to appear. Now in here, you could select your Java edition and you could select which release you want to play. You also have installations in here in case you want to add a new installation to play a different release of Minecraft. You could enable alpha betas editions. You could download mods. You could install mod packs. You could do a lot of things with Minecraft Java. I prefer Minecraft Java over Bedrock. And even though it says that Bedrock edition is not playable on this device, there's some workarounds to do to play the Bedrock edition. So let me know down in the comments if you would like to know how to play the bedrock edition but in this video we're gonna finish it off with playing the java edition all you have to do is hit play and wait for minecraft to finish installing now as you can see you're able to play minecraft on your mac if this video helped you all guys don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys next time